a player that's currently in the Spurs team right now that you gave your ge- debut to in Gareth Bale. Um, so Gareth Bale, you bought Gareth Bale, you gave him his debut. Um, did you ever think that he could turn out the way he did when you bought him? I saw Gareth, you know, when we had our games at Stevenage, you know, our, our, every Monday I went to Stevenage to, to watch the reserves and then they played against Southampton with Kieran Dyer. He was uh, playing for uh, Southampton. Uh, Tia Walcott was playing for Southampton and, and Gareth Bell was playing for Southampton. And I can rem- I remember him having a number five and he, so he was left back and he had an unbelievable free kick, you know, he, he, was, he, he, was, he was physically good. So that is why I thought, you know, and that was Spurs. That was that was different because at Man United, because I can remember him, his mom telling us, you know, he could go to Man United as well. And I said, yeah, but mom, he will never play there in the first team. And, and she agreed. And I said, I will play him. And, and I could say that, you know, because I had no one on the left. Because maybe you can remember Reto Ziegler. He was 17 or 18 and he had to play on the left because... He was the only player I had. Later, I had Steve Malbronk, and he was, he was a good player. Yeah. But Garrett Bell, of course, he was a left back. And I saw him and I thought, I said to his mom, mom, he will play. And that was the reason that they decided to come to Spurs and not go to Man United. So, so that was good. And the Saturday uh, after it, I had to play him against, uh, against Man United because I had to put my, my uh, money where my mouth is. So I had to play him. And, and, and I did play him. And... I mean, I think he did 12 or 13 kilometers in his first game. He was so fit, you know, but I agree with other people like with Harry. Harry saw as well, like what I saw, he's not a left back, you know, he's a, he's an offensive player with his power, with his speed. And of course, you know, I was always uh, proud to see him, you know, because if you saw what the, what the, what the guy did at Real Madrid and especially in that time with, uh, with Spurs, you know, he, he's amazing and yeah, ho- hopefully, hopefully he will stay, you know, because I think he's a Spurs player. And, and if, he, if he can show what he can do, you know, and if you give him a little bit of confidence, because that is important, even when you're 30 or over 30, I think he could do probably the same as he did in his prime. Mm. Oh, wow. That's a quite a big statement. Yeah!